what that means. It's twitching. <sighs> no! God, you gotta be kidding me! We got something up ahead. I don't like this game anymore. Oh my God, <laughs> that's insane! Damn it. Roads blocked. Oh, now we gotta deal with this. That's a bit of a roadblock. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. Yeah, it's a little rough. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. And I'd like everyone out of the RV except her. I don't want folks trapped in there with her. What are we gonna do with her? Oh man. Ugh. Poor duck. It's gonna Why start. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Claire, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? Hadn't crossed my mind. At <laughs> least we didn't lose our sense of humor. Okay. So, me and Shaggy are going to check out the train. Box car door. That's one hell of a mess. One hell of a mess. I said that already. Doors closed. <laughs> Alright, let's talk to this dude. What would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. I don't know if I should accuse him or not. Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No! Okay, then. Oh, good. He won't forget that. You, uh, happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Good talk. <laughs> that was awesome. All right, where should I go? Should I use the boxcar door? Go up the ladder? I don't know which way to go in. The door to the boxcar. I would look. See, if I, I would look in the window there first. That's what I would do. Right, I'm gonna use the ladder. Let's see what's up here. Engine compartment. Look at the cab door. Yeah, let's look in here first. Oh, Shit. great. We got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. Oh, I don't know if I want to do that. I don't know if I've got any choice, though.
Okay. <sighs> Suppose we ought to look him over. Yeah. I don't want to do that. I don't want to touch the engineer. Well, that's kind of gross. Somebody already shot him. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push, Push it. it. Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. <sighs> it's Whoa. just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. <laughs> no clue. Well, let's look around. Maybe it goes somewhere we'd like to be. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. How? How far can we go with this thing? Alright, let's see. Before we get too far here... I want to check out this other stuff. Might be something inside. Might be something inside. Really? Might be something inside. Can we open the doors? Oh, yeah. Where's my gun? Take the wrench. Spanner or the monkey wrench? Take the monkey wrench. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Spike remover? Hmm. Lots of good stuff in here. Yeah, we're gonna take... Oh, I can only take one? <laughs> He's gonna give the same look to any of them. Alright, let's take the monkey wrench. That's the one I want. Darn encumbrance rules. Alright, let's go. Is there different stuff in each of these? Apparently. Look at the switch. Switch. Should I touch this? Prime no. the engine. All right. Anything else? No. And zombie. Nothing in that one. Nothing here. And there was, was there a fourth? This is the dangerous one, of course. Okay, we opened up four scary doors and nothing bad happened. I would say that's a win. This is a pretty good day so far. Besides Carly getting shot and Duck being bitten and Clementine almost killing me because I had a nasty dream. Yeah, I, I would look in there first. Hey, there's a shoe outlet. Oh, whoa. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit, think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Alright, what do we got here? Water. Looks unopened. Nice. I'll take this to Kendra for Duck. Look at the map. The clipboard. I'm the map. I'm the map. A map of where the train Sorry. goes. 
I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. Good. That was a nice find. Alright, so I can go out this way. Let's go out the other side walk so I can be all alone out here. It seems like a good thing to do. Coupler pin. <laughs> There's got to be a better way to do this. So what am I trying to do? Looks like it'll get that pin out. Oh, we want to unhitch it? <sighs> it's stuck. I can definitely pry this thing free. If I can break it loose first. Shit. Broken. So what do I need to go get the, uh, the pry bar thingy? Alright, maybe we need a different tool for the job. We gotta talk to Lily. Look at pencil. Why do I need to look that at the pencil? pencil? Sharpen too. Hmm, this is getting curious. Let me grab it. Might need that. Save some time later when I'm trying to figure out the puzzle. Wait. I'm leaving. Don't move. Don't you fucking move. I'm not going to hurt you. Come with me. We could take the RV right now. He left the keys in it. Come on, Lily. Didn't think you would say yes. I can't let you take the RV. Don't be crazy. You're not letting me take it. Sorry, Lee. I really am. Oh, crap. Oh, my God. She's stealing the RV! Lily! Come back here, you crazy bitch! Fuck! Stop! Wow. I got the pencil, though. That was important. It was sharpened, too. Let's focus on the train. Man, that sucked. <laughs> well, we're fucked if we don't figure out how this thing works. Can't spend the night out here. Yeah, that kind of made things bad. How'd she get out? Didn't we tie her up? I guess she got out of Ducky's that. Ducky's still sick, you know. We need to get to the city, the coast. I know. Okay. So, uh... Yeah. Here, Clementine, here's some water. Found it for you. Anything out here before I go over there? I can't believe she took it. So they were totally right in, uh... Here, found some water. Wanting to leave her behind. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like... Somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. Or just to bees. What does that have to do with anything? All right, let's check in with Clementine first. Hey, sweet pea, you okay out here? No. I don't think Duck feels good. Uh, me neither. And he's going to turn into a vicious little biter soon. Huh. 
pal stuck. I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. He's gonna start exactly. burning up. Has Clementine said anything to you about Carly or Duck or anything? I'm worried about her. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor Carly. God, where did yesterday go? Yesterday was better. I don't know. Are you okay? I know you were fond of her. I was. This isn't any time for, you know, romance, but yeah. I was, uh, fond of her, yeah. I'm sorry about the RV. I'm worried. We're really on our own out here now. Well, we're putting some time into this train. Worst comes to worse. The boxcar's safe enough to sleep in. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Ken took off in a hurry. We think the train might actually work. Trying to find out how to start the engine. How? I have no idea. <laughs> well, someone must have known, right? You're right. Ben. I got no idea how to get the engine started. That guy in the cab probably knew. Yeah, well, he isn't talking. Well, he had to learn it somewhere. All right, we need a manual or something. Let's get back up here, switch out my uh, tool. We need the prior, right? Which, which of these doors was it? Mm, this one, right? Now there's a zombie! Oh. All right, what's this? Spike remover, spanner. I don't know, I guess this one? Maybe. I'll try that one. The good news is, these are all equally good for bashing in zombie brains. So. Alright, I don't think we learned everything we need. You need this pencil? I found a pencil. Alright, let's look at the picture. Let's get a little crying action in here. Notepad. Shit, this is it. Engine Instructions startup. on starting the engine. And Damn. it's ripped. Pages are gone. So I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. We need to do the leaf rubbing. The leaf rubbing. That's why I got the pencil. See? Look at me. Rotten lunch. Mmm. <laughs> no. Mmm. I'm going to do a pencil rubbing. Perfect. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. All right. Yeah. S oh, six. Uh, six. Uh, down, switch, down, switch, up, switch, up, switch, up, down, up. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. These flippy switches, ver uh, horizontal, vertical for five, nine turned counterclockwise, and then nine clockwise. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. Oh, these are the switches. Number six, down, down, up, up. Down, down. Up, up, up. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did lit the dash up! And scared me. So far, so good. Alright, what did I do? Come now on. we're talking. Yes. Now we are talking. Let's get this. I want to look at the map first. It's a bunch of papers. It's a bu get the papers. Get the papers. A bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. Okay. 
Let's show this map to Kenny before we start the whole thing up. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This horse will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. I can't believe it. What about Doc? What about him? We can't act like nothing happened to him. We can't act like he's dead, either. Well, okay. we kind of... enough. Try to get this thing started. There's got to be some sort of manual or something. <laughs> I don't know about that. That's the spirit. <laughs> Alright, so what else? Uh, number nine, counterclockwise. And then clockwise. There is no number nine. Is number nine the engine primer thingy out in the... Is that what number nine is? That's Did that say number nine? Let's see. Number nine! There we go. Turn switch right. Engine ready. Turn switch left. All right, that should be it. Should be able to start this puppy up. There we go. Oh, did I just, I turned it the wrong way the first time. Holy shit, we're golden. That was dumb, sorry. So what? We're barreling down the tracks at 40 miles an hour. I don't care about the noise. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. It's all yours. Oh, good. That's the throttle. Damn it. Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck and get us unstuck? Yeah. All right, now can we open it? Should I keep the same tool? All right, this is where the bad thing happens. There we go. There. Hey, Kenny, we're loose. Foot loose. You touch any of my stuff? Oh, boy. How did he get there with nobody else seeing? the map of the train routes. That's fine. You can have that. Really? Yeah. I got them all right up here. Okay. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab? Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off It's you. a good thing you didn't. But I couldn't force myself to do it. It's still kind of freaking me out. <laughs> I mean, folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. So we got a new person? Is he coming with us? What's going on? Oh, he's got a guitar! You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. How is he normal? 
He gave us candy. Ben, too. Candy? Don't take candy from strangers. Look at him. <laughs> this is like, I'm not eating. Got my milk, dudes. You have candy? What's your game, man? Keeping him alive. That's not bad. I like it. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <laughs> Was I really gone that long that he got to know everybody already? I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. We Thank stole your water, too. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on... Uh... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Okay, play us a song. Let's learn a little bit more about hey, Chuck. Howdy. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. I met before. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine, then. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. The spirit's getting a little That's tainted. Some kind of something. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. Alright, Ben. Why'd you take all the candy? How you doing, Ben? I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? <laughs> but you gotta eat candy, dude. <laughs> you got to eat candy. I better get back to it. <laughs> I love how they have nothing more to say. Come on, you got some raisinets or some goobers, people? Hey, sweet pea. That candy Chuck gave you. It taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. It was better... <laughs> It was better than the Pretty human. Cool, huh? I guess. Scary, kind of. Alright, let's... What are we doing here? So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. Woo we don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Got my pencil. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Hey, don't yell at her. You freak. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. Is the train really a good idea with Duck like that? Maybe we should focus on one thing at a time. Yes. What can we do here? We get on the train and we find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through. Get on, Cat. Okay. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. I'm the one that has to. I'm the one that's gonna have to kill Duck. Why don't I drive the train? All right, maybe I will. They'll all be dead back there. All right, here we go. I like how Kenny's in the driver's seat, but I get to hit the throttle. All right, there we go, he moved. Choo-choo! Oh, that's a nice little train ride. Little, little sick boy. All right. <gasps> I 
Come on, we're not gonna have any gratuitous zombie on the track. Well, probably never thought they'd ride a train again. They gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. <laughs> There were more of us. Dad, get him. Yes. Oh, it's a shame. Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Oh, I love getting that off his face. Yeah, let me use the wrench. That's a rag. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? No. No, no, no. Look, no. No, we don't... No. I, are you crazy? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. Well, how are we going to convince Kenny of that? Let me just talk to Clementine real I'm quick. I'm gonna go get Kenny. Hold on tight in case the train stops fast. She doesn't seem to be listening. Kenny's not gonna stop. We're gonna have to get uh, harsh with him, I think. Stop the train. All right, I'll stop the train. Show the rag to Kenny. Grab Kenny. Hmm. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. Wake the fuck up, man. This is over. That's right. He's dead. Don't you tell me to wake up. I got a real family I'm trying to protect. Not that fucking sham you're running back there. I don't want to talk to him. I want to punch him. I want to punch him. They're not giving me the options. Fight him. You're acting like nothing's wrong. There you go. Somebody's gotta knock some sense into it. I you. got the option. I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this, and you bet your ass I'm gonna. You keep trying those slow motion punches. I got this, man. Give a fuck that we don't get along. I'm not letting you do this to Cat and Duck. Slow motion punch. You want to hurt people because you're afraid. Losing Duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. Did I kill him? No, don't kill him. All right. Not apologizing. I knock some sense into him. Good. Come on, Kenny, stop that thing like a jerk nose. Come on, go mourn your son. Ken, it's... I think it's time. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out.
What do you need? I... I... Katja. It's time to... This is not possible. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... Oh, what if he doesn't? Is, this is gonna fall to me, I isn't it? Very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Can just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here uh. or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. Gotcha. Fuck. I, I, I can I could do this. I'll do it. No, it should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. Lee's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Ugh. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Oh, yeah, Maya, this is heavy. truth Ugh. I'm putting him out of his misery oh yeah look Clem things are what the oh. no! Ben take Clementine into the train go it'll be fine they did it or did he turn oh no Okay, no time to be sad. <laughs> 